Sup guys, Chip Six around here coming at you with part 23 of the white playthrough. And look at this, jumping right into this stuff. And here is Clay, the gym leader, look at that. And he's all cowboyish. And he's like, yeah, you guys can challenge him if you get rid of Team Plasma. Okay. It's kind of shady, but that's, I don't know. Oh, that's kind of dumb. I wish I could just march him in the gym, but can't do that. Let's see if we can get some items here. Yeah, I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. Alright. Let's see about this one right here. Now uh, this this guy will teach your Pokemon um, the pledge moves. So like fire pledge, water pledge, and grass pledge. And if you use those in like a double battle, they like double their power or something, I don't know. Something like that. But a lot of buildings to go into in this uh, city. So if you want some items you can always just do what I'm doing, go talk to everybody. Which is always kind of nice. This looks like a place where you get items. 50 or more. What? I'll, we'll trade my basket with your Mancino. You can actually catch Mancino down below here. So, down by the cold storage. So I would highly recommend doing that trade. Because Mancino is not going to do any good in this gym. And... It looks like Basculin will because it's a ground type gym. Alright. Okay, Rock Smash. Rock Smash. Do I have Rock Smash? Let's see, do I have Rock Smash? Um, no. Oh! Yes, I do. Let's teach it. Um, there's a TM too. Let's go. No one likes thrash. Alright, let's check what she wants to give me now. Alright, sweet. Heart scale, I love it. That's a pretty good reward. I can always get rid of that move whenever I want, so. Alright, come over here. And we can sneak in the back way. Pick up a nice big pearl to sell. So, if you want that, and here's a guy, but we're going to talk to him a little later. What do we got over here? It's surf and stuff, but, well, let's talk to this guy. He looks like he might give us some. Oh, if this Pokemon knew surf, he could go on top of the water. I feel you, dog. I wish I had surf. What's this place? This place is more of interest in black and white too. I don't think anyone's gonna get me anything in this stupid place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Whatever. Well, the gym's over there and you can't even go over there yet, so... You can actually go this way if you want to, but... Being more buildings in this. I remember there being more items too. Oh well. I think in drift. I think I'm talking about um, black and white twos. Drift wheels. City. What are you doing here? Come here. What does this guy want? Oh, once we get the gym badge, we'll come back to this guy. One dozen, that's a nice deal. Twelve bottles of moo milk for six hundred bucks, you kidding me? Or six thousand, I'm not sure. Either way, it's a freaking good deal. Let's see. These po uh, those moves are really good, or those items are really good, but they make your Pokemon uh, hate you, so I wouldn't really recommend that. And we better go into the Pokemon Center. <laughs> I still haven't went to the Pokemon Center of this town yet. At least we're having fun, right? That's the most important thing. Now, Driftville City, um, it's kind of, eh, it's okay, I guess. 
Not my favorite city. Most favorite city in the entire place. Ah, sweet, sweet Mountain Dew. But, um, it's okay. It's Clay is, uh, he's pretty challenging if you don't have the right Pokemon for him. But we have some pretty strong Pokemon with us. Good now. So over here, I think, we'll see here. Triple battle. This is a triple battle in white and a rotation battle, I think, in, um, uh, black. I'm sorry. I couldn't think of it. <laughs> Motorcyclist Charles. So this is a new kind of battle technique introduced into this generation. It's kind of stupid if you ask me, but whatever. Intimidate. Good thing we're all special attackers. Okay. That was a very well placed crocker out there, buddy. Scald that thing. Um, let's leaf tornado that thing and spark. We have some really good uh, things for this. Really good matchups for this guy. My zip strike is faster than his zip strike. I like it. Uh oh, that's gonna hurt. Do a lot of damage, please. But we're all around the same level, so that's kind of bad, but. I'm surprised Rattler is the slowest on my team. That's really surprising. Um, I like the Leaf Tornado misses. That's some bullcrap. But, uh, let's take out Basculin here. And hopefully he doesn't take out Babspell, but wouldn't be the end of the world. 29. I like it. Love it. Level 30, there we can go. We can go talk to that other dude now. Get an item. Shockwave. That'll knock me out. Oh well. Oh. Let's go. Accuracy fell. Targaryen, let's go. You see now, I mean, if I hit him one time with any move I have, just it's, it's over. Can I attack with quick attack over the next spot? Thunder? Charge. No, but it failed. <laughs> That's pretty stupid. So probably do some nice damage to Garamaka. I just it just baffles me how slow Rattler is. But oh well. Are we sitting for time? Pretty solid. Only eight minutes. I like it. I like it. I love it. All right, Zeb Striker, level twenty-eight. I'm a fan of that too. Whichever battle to Opelousa City. Okay, thanks. What does this chick sell again? I haven't even talked to her. That guy Charles. He's in here stealing all the merchandise. Expert belt. Nice. That's a nice item right there. Holy, that's nice. It increases the power of super effective moves. Do we have a thousand machine gun? There it is. Here's where you want to come now, though. Cold storage. But, I think we're going to go... I don't know, what, what's the time here? You know what? I think we can do this right here. But I'm going to go heal up quick, so see you in a second. Okay, we're back. And... We are going to fight the trainers outside here what we're going to do, just to make this episode a little less boring. Youngster Kenneth, he seems to have his whirlipede against me. That's okay, we can just flame charge it. Probably two times, I guess. I mean, flame charge and substrike is nice and everything, but I mean, it's so freaking fast in the first place, like... <laughs> it's like one of the fastest Pokemon you can get, kind of, in the regular main series game. Poison point, yeah. Jeez. God. Now he's gonna use protect, because he's a little noob. Protect toxic trainers in game are just, just annoying. Like, 
Look at this. He'll probably get two protects, too. Yep, here goes my zip strike as hell. Alright, hopefully he only has one Pokemon. Nice. Double speed. Alright, so we'll be faster than these. I don't care about us. We'll knock that on one hit. That thing's terrible. Look at this. Indoor. He has all these ways of just lowering your health with poison. Look at this BS cheese right now. Yeah, endured the hit. See, but it knocked him out. Now he needs a quick attack. Boom. What do we got over here? Another youngster. How are there youngsters <laughs> this far in the game? Like, he should be at least like a just a regular trainer. You shouldn't be a young guy if you come this far in the game. In my opinion, of course, but I guess I'm wrong. We might be able to knock this Jolting out. But uh the size comparisons in this battle right now are just they just don't do justice. Like Joltik is so small. My god, like, if you've seen the anime, it battles against uh, a bear tick, and it just gets knocked out because bear tick falls over on it. That's how tiny it is. It's just, you can't really see it. I don't, I don't know, maybe I'll have to catch one just to show you how, like, small it actually is. I mean, I want to say it's under a foot long easily under a foot, like six inches or something like that, I want to say. Here's Dwebble. Sturdy, yeah, look at that. Jeez. Well, bye-bye. Zip -bye. strike him. Oh, well. Hopefully Terry hits, or else he's gonna take a big old rock type move to the face. Oh, he has rock smash. Boom. Using a new move. Dad, I couldn't win. What do we got for an item over here? Nice hyper potion, look at that. I don't think this guy battles you. Yeah, whatever. Talk to this guy for sure. He gives you a great item, Rocky Helmet. Put that on your defensive walls and it does like... I want to say like an eighth or something damage, a fifth, something like that. It's ridiculous. A peepee -pee up. Now we're gonna walk over here, but first we're gonna run into some wild Pokemon. And some of the Pokemon you can run into, I, would, I never recommend fighting Pokemon like in the regular regular grass when we got higher level ones right next door in these this thick grass, but. If you want to catch them at a lower level, you can. But we got more trainers to fight over here. And you got some nice Pokemon in this area. You can catch Machino, Timber, Vanillish actually. Vanillish is a pure ice type. It evolves into Vanillox. Vanillish, or Vanilla, Vanillish, Vanillox, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure I'm girl. And very good ice type. Very good ice type. I mean, I've used it several times. No problems with it at all. It does its job nicely. Special attacking ice type Pokemon. Come in like Flash Cannon, I think. And it's an overall great Pokemon. So, highly recommend if you need an ice type or you're looking to add an ice type to your team. Because there's some nice dragons uh, later in the game that Vanilla or Vanillox at that point would love to take out. It actually, um, it actually doesn't evolve until like level 48 or something like that. So it's really late, but and here's a protein. And yeah, let's see if we got anything else over here. Yeah, here's your vanilla right here. Vanilla, I'm so sorry. I'm just stupid. But for me, am I going to catch it? No, <laughs> I'm not gonna use vanilla, vanilla in this game. One more, I guess, for the show. 
you know, it wants me to catch it. Hey, that looks like the same vanilla or vanilla. <laughs> God, looks like the same vanilla. One more. Here's Charon. And one more item up here. Heart scale. Sweet. So we got some nice items coming in here. And it looks like in the next episode we're going to be diving into the actual building of the cold storage. So I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you all next time.